Hey everybody, what's going on? It's all you know. I'm bringing you guys my second of three gameplays I'm going to be posting of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare this weekend using the KF5 Genuine Submachine Gun with the Advanced Rifling Attachment and the Foregrip Attachment. And I go 46 and 15 in this gameplay. I dropped a 40 bomb on these guys, and this is on the map Skyrise and Classic Team Deathmatch. Uh, hope you guys enjoy, and let's jump into the gameplay. So, like I said, this is my second gameplay this weekend out of three that I will be posting, and this is not an every weekend thing, this is just a one-time deal because I managed to get um, two pretty good gameplays leading up to this weekend. I think I got this one on the same night that I post. No, I got this one the night before that I got the DNA bomb, so that would probably have been Wednesday or Thursday. So this is a rather old gameplay, but... It's still a good gameplay nonetheless, and it is in Classic Team Deathmatch, my favorite game mode in Advanced Warfare, aside from maybe Domination. But the attachments, Advanced Rifling, because in some machine guns it's kind of one of the more popular attachments to use, just gives you more range, or uh, more damage at a longer range. And then Foregrip, for the same reason as always, just want to make sure that my gun doesn't recoil like a donkey. Or I should have said kick there, not recoil. My bad, but you get the you get the analogy and the reference I was trying to get across. Uh, because foregrip is a lifesaver in every Call of Duty that it's been in. It just it's so beautiful of an attachment. I just I can't get enough of it. If it was a female and it was dateable, I would be dating a foregrip. That's how much I like that attachment. Um, but I'm really not going to talk much about the gameplay because, I mean, I'll let the gameplay speak for itself. I drop a 40 bomb. I did get quite a bit of deaths, but it all ended up equaling out with the high amount of kills being almost 50. So I managed to just say, well, I didn't manage. I just decided to say, screw it. You know, 15 deaths doesn't look anything compared to 46 kills in a classic team deathmatch. So... You know, I just figured, why not? You might as well just post it. It could have been worse. So, yeah, that's about it, guys. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the remainder of the gameplay. And um, tomorrow will be my NA-45 sniper rifle gameplay. Uh, still haven't yet to unlock Danger Close yet. So, if any... I mean, in hardcore, I don't really think it's necessary. But it's, it's kind of just like you want to have it just to make sure... So I might be grinding all night tonight just to get to Danger Close so I can use it for the uh, gameplay tomorrow, which will be episode 17 of my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay with every gun series of videos. So look out for that tomorrow. Once again, this is episode number, not episode, this is the second gameplay of three that I will be posting this weekend using the KF5 Genuine Submachine Gun with the advanced rifling attachment and the foregrip attachment going 46 and 15 on Skyrise and Classic Team Deathmatch. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you have any comments or uh, any remarks or anything you want to talk about with me, uh, leave it down in the comment below and I'll try to get back to you as quick as I can. But aside from that, thank you all for taking the time to watch. I hope you enjoyed and I will talk to you guys tomorrow with episode number 17 of my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay with every gun series of videos. Thank you all for watching. the UAV above.
UAV is online. the advantage. We've taken the lead. Lost control. We've taken control. We've lost the advantage. At the side, Chris. In the UAV above. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 